Hello, I'm Sammy, welcome back to my channel. We're back in Dragalia Lost in the post-mortem panic event. And uh, I did all the quests, so you don't have to watch me go through that. Which means I can just go through all the story. Ah, uh, here we go. Zombies encircle the Haladum, but Melsa has a plan to break the sinister siege. Whoa, what the hell? How did a zombie get in your room, Akasha? I carried it here after it attacked Cerise. I have an extensive battery of experiments I'm eager to perform on it. Uh, oh, and I sealed its movement with magic, so you needn't fear its bite. Zombies, zombie bites are like the seventh scariest thing about everything you just said. Are you sure about all this, Melsa? Yes, they hesitated when they saw my costume. They think I'm one of them. If I can play the part convincingly enough, I should be able to slip through and get to the man who is controlling them. It's Zombie 101, and this poor fellow here is going to be my professor. First, I need to master the zombie mode. Well, how did I do? <laughs> Jesus. Hmm, kinda cute. Okay, how about this? More forceful than the last attempt, but I fear a certain adorable aspect remains. Then this! These timorous yups make mockery of the lamentations of the dead. Let the despair well up within you. Use your diaphragm. Oh, geez, that's better. Yes, perfect. Wait, hang on. When did this guy show up? What the heck is happening? Well, we couldn't help but overhear you earlier. If there's any way we can help, please tell us. I don't want to just sit here shaking my boots. We got a plan and want in on it. It's the least we could do after seeing Melsa put her neck on the line for us. Yeah, we're not going to sit around doing nothing while she's fighting for our sake. Ah, you guys. Okay, here's how you can help. Whoa. Okay, did he get turned into a zombie? Thus, they joined together to prepare as the dying light of the sun gave way to the darkest night. Jeez, why? Why with the rhyming? I got a busted weapon and hammered it back into working condition. Take it. It can only be used once, and avoid using it at point blank range. It's too powerful. Oh, gun unit, of course. Thank you both. I still feel like I should go with you. Someone has to stay here and keep all these people safe, Cerise. Yeah, I know, but... Look, just come back safe and sound, alright? Okay. Right, I'm off. Jesus. Okay. Jesus. Is it working? Yes, they're buying it. An exemplary performance, Melsa. I dare say I've never seen a more compelling zombie. Yeah, that weird priest turned out to be a surprisingly good vocal coach. Wow, Kashina, why are you here? Huh? Yeah, why is she here? Come on to us, what now? Just kill him. Oh, wow. Haladon Balcony. Keep those power blossoms going up. We need to keep their attention on us. Right. Wow, really? It appears the pyrotechnics have the zombies wrapped attention. Akasha, what are you doing here? And how are you here? I constructed this costume based on tales of vampires and more than a little magical technology, and it grants me their powers. They're kind of said to take the form of mist to hide their presence at night. These raiments sadly won't transmogrify me into damp weather, but obscuring me from observers was a simple matter. So you decided to come back me up? A quarry is controlling the undead with a grimoire, so I thought it prudent we bring someone versed in magic. Now, onwards. Okay. Alright. Well, that's easy enough, isn't it? We finally made it through the castle gates, but there's still a ton of zombies. Gotta stay focused. Good evening! <laughs> Okay, I'm serious he's making a small talk with a zombie right now. War rations, flaky, tasty. I'm very curious. It seems this one retains a small spark of intelligence. Inter-human. Oh no, it's drawing the other's attention. They're swarming for the gates. They're all out of pyroblossoms. 
Good thing I've still got arrows. Uh, what that do? They're not stopping. Acting isn't going to get us through this one. Uh, this outfit's cloaking effect cannot fool so many eyes at once. Hostages for my family. Whoa, what? We're done for. No, we ain't. Oh, it's these guys. Cool. You? This means we're square, lady. Now leave these uglies to us and go. Come on, you walking stick of jerky. You're dealing with me and my bro now. If you dead idiots are that hungry, you can all eat my fists. Cool, good for them. They're surrounded, we have to help them. There's little we can do for them now. Come, you must make haste. But they came to your aid knowing full well the fate which awaited them. Was wasting this chance and making their sacrifice for naught not the crueler choice? Fine. I'm so sorry, you two, but thank you. So, <laughs> just leave them to die? Is that what happened? This story is not great. Why are the stories so bad this year? Melsa and Akasha make for the lakeside to steal the necromancy term away from the man who is controlling the zombie horde. And did he find him? <sighs> Dear me, Melsa, are the gentlemen who offered themselves as bait still weighing on your mind? Or is this about Cerise? Both, but even more than that, I'm thinking about the zombie we met back at the castle gate, the one that spoke. We said hostages and for my family. What does that even mean? I expect the creature retained some powerful emotion from when it yet lived. In the war 300 years ago, the Empire conscripted those living in its lands by force. It would scarce surprise me if the Empire took some of that zombie's family hostage to compel them to fight beneath its banner. Thankfully, such captives were generally released at the war's end and permitted to become citizens of Alberia, living out the rest of their days in peace. But these poor zombies don't know that. They're still fighting against their will. You look positively forlorn, dear. What kind of kind soul you are. Well, here's a riddle to cheer you up. I am both deadly weapon and fatal weakness. What am I? A weapon and a weakness? Something that can kill, I suppose. Kill them with... Point taken, Akasha. Don't worry, I'm not going to hold back with everyone's lives on the line. How nice to hear that my concerns were completely unfounded. We're nearly to the lake now. Let us focus. Right. Right! What the hell is happening? Oi. Hey, watch it with the bony fingers. I said massage me, not impale me. <sighs> Are those stupid zombies still not Zombie done storming the castle? Me Sitting back and giving orders is great, but being stuck here waiting is lame. I thought the Imperials are done. Done, sir. Look at Yon Sorcerer there. He carries the Legion Immortalis. If we can take it from him, that should stop the zombie invasion. Okay. But there are so many of them, getting close is going to be tough. Is this not an opportune time to make use of our cargo, Melsa? Oh, right! Cargo? What the hell are you talking about? Did your ears fall off? I said gentle, I swear, you think a zombie masseuse would be easy to find. Gentle does not mean stop, sludge brain. Huh, that's weird. There's something coming this- Crap, is that a fireball? Oh my god! Really? Ugh! And there's good zombie bits all over the place. What the hell was that thing? Something from the castle armory that I'm told is called a mana caster. A rock and smith fixed it up enough to fire once. You're from the Haladon. How did you get here? You've no zombies left to save you. Now hand over that book. No way! I put traps and fiends in an ancient burial ground in order to trap this thing now. These zombies are my ticket up the ladder to become emperor someday. And b believe you me, conquering the Haladim is going to look great on my resume. Wait, who, wait, who's going to hire you, man? A truly remarkable portrayal of the classic two-bit villain. It seems that Grimoire is a relic far above your station. Now be a good boy and do as you're told, or I feel we'll have to... Do something. What are you doing? Stay back! Oh my god. <laughs> oh, don't. What? Oh. Zombies were hiding in the dirt. You gotta keep your ace card hidden until the very last minute. Oh, and that's not your average animated meat chunk. That fellow there used to be a commander. Let her have it, Commander Z. Oh, really? Really? Get away from her. 
Kasha, hold on. I'm going to. Oh no, she's not. Wait, really? Freaking really? <laughs> dumbest stuff I've ever seen. Oh. Wait, seriously? She barely got touched. Still, she's gonna go and die that easy. Then how can I resist a little? Really? She's gonna do it again. She's not dead though, right? Oh wow. Akasha? When is the true terror of the Legion and Mortalis? Each life in my army claims to come to its newest pawn. Oh, and pro tip, then this next part is going to be a lot easier if you dispense with all the screaming, fleeing, or whatever, and just agree to help me out. Great. No, the creatures we blew up are already back on their feet. See? I'm sure you'd make a passable zombie, but this Halidon business is taking way too long. So I'll make you an offer. Work for me and convince your old allies to open the gates, thereby closing the doors of my incredibly clever trap right at, on their tootsies. Never. Uh, you do realize I command an immortal army of the risen dead here, right? I was obvious enough about that? You guys have zero chance of winning, so I feel like my offer to spare your life is actually a pretty sweet deal. I'll not let my friend die. She believes in me and trusted me enough to send me out here. All manner of people helped me get this far, in fact. I would sooner die than betray that trust. This whole power of friendship thing is such a pain sometimes, but oh well. You just have to be my zombie instead. I go, except you, Homendazi. You're still on bodyguard duty. <laughs> really? Ah, Kashi's not dead. She's just playing. I won't lose to you when everyone is counting on me. Okay. Ha, huh, not bad. Maybe even decent. But let's see how you fare against my newest recruit. Wow, really? No, Akasha. Akasha isn't... She's playing, dude. Like you said, I barely even touched her. Alright, well, that is all the time I have for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!